It's difficult to comprehend what's happened in Victoria throughout the past two and a half years. For many of us, it's felt like a bad dream where the government denied healthy people their right to work. The entire state was locked down. Melbourne City became a shadow of its former self. And sadly, Victorians started turning on each other based on their personal health decisions. I would love to forget about what we've experienced, but that's exactly what the Victorian government wants us to do. The Victorian government wants us to forget it implemented some of the most extreme authoritarian policies from anywhere in the world. Our community was divided, police powers expanded, permitting authorities to enter our houses without warrants, and our children's learning and social development was neglected. The institutions that were supposed to protect our human rights and dignity failed us, but we kept going. Along with my colleague Tim Quilty, it's been a privilege to represent Victorians, particularly those of you who defended your freedoms throughout such a challenging period. Alongside you, we fought every day since we were elected in 2018 for individual liberty. In my inaugural speech, I said, I believe in the individual. There are no human rights without individual rights. Self-ownership is the idea that a person owns their own body and as long as they do not cause harm to others, they may act as they see fit and no one, including government, should interfere in this. And in the words of John Stuart Mill, over himself, over his own body and mind, the individual is sovereign. So whether there's a pandemic or not, this is our belief. Regardless of who wins the state election, if enough Liberal Democrats are elected, we can stop authoritarian legislation in its tracks. We will ensure that you're protected from government overreach and nanny state legislation. Imagine how the last two and a half years would have been with more Liberal Democrats elected to Parliament. You have the power to vote on the 26th of November. The Liberal Democrats will fight for you. Authorised by R. Westgar for the Liberal Democratic Party, Docklands, Victoria.